Welcome to the Silver Rush, New Vegas' best source of laser and plasma weapons. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to search you before letting you in. The only weapons allowed on the premises are the ones we're selling. It should only take a moment. There, I've stored all of your weapons, and you're clear to enter. When you leave, I'll hand them all back to you. The bosses are having a meeting. You'll have to wait until it's over. Mr. Soren, please get to the point. The second half of your payment is late, and I want to know why. Miss Van Graff, my associates and I have decided that we wish to renegotiate the terms of our deal. Might I ask for what reason? The shipment was delivered. The guns were tested before leaving this facility. Regardless, we feel that the quality of the weapons is below expectation and hope to adjust the price accordingly. Ah, I think I understand what the issue here is. Excuse me for a moment, would you? Do it. Never break faith with the Van Graffs, Mr. Soren. I expect you'll have the rest of our payment ready tomorrow morning. You people okay, are crazy! Everyone. Show's over. Back to work. Hello. Get the fuck away from me. The last man who bothered me volunteered to help test our weapons. Welcome to the Silver Rush, where only top-of-the-line energy weapons can be found. What can I do for you? Of course. Welcome to the Silver Rush. Wonderful. I already have a man outside who can show you the ropes and get you set up. His name is Simon. He's been with the family for years, so listen to what he says and follow his instructions. Welcome to the Sylve. Ah, oh, crap. Don't tell me you're my new guard. You can always tell a rookie. You look too eager. Get the job a few hours, and the shine will come right off. You'll be covering the other side of the door there. Take your position while I get your stuff out. Customers and risks can enter and exit the area. I'll get your gear ready. Okay, now let's get you geared up. First, your armor. Standard issue is your run-of-the-mill combat armor, with a nice dark coat of paint for both brand recognition and sheer intimidation bag. Next, your weapon. Guards are required to use rifles. Anything lighter compromises your combat effectiveness. Anything heavier and people are too scared to come in the door. What's your preference, laser or plasma? Nothing wrong with going plasma. Just make sure you hit what you're aiming at. Now that you're equipped, a quick word on the job at hand. In a nutshell, we're here to keep the riffraff away. Drunks, punks, and capless vermin are to be turned away. Potential customers are to be permitted normal entrance. That is, after we pat them down for weapons. An unarmed man is a lot less likely to try to steal something with several armed guards around. Don't start any fights. I don't care if some jet junkie just insulted your mother. We're here to promote violence elsewhere, and I started here. Lastly, don't abandon your post. We're getting paid to stand next to this door, not talk to someone down the street or head to the casino. That goes double for any thoughts of splitting with that gear. Every now and then, some young punk thinks he can run off with Van Graaff property. Trust me, the rifle and armor are nice, but they're not worth your life. Other than that, relax. 
There's usually some eye candy coming and going from the Wrangler over there at some point, so the view's not too bad. Settle in. You got some hours left before your shift ends. Here comes a winner. I'll let you handle this one. Pick up a laser gun. Sounds like a stupid policy to me. Good. Stick to the rules. Another one coming. You're on. Hi. I was, uh, in the area and thought I'd stop by to look at your weapons. Can I go in? Fine by me. He's clean. See? Not so hard, is it? Heads up. Looks like we got another customer. I just done broke the bank over at the Wrangler there and thought I might peruse your fine wares. Maybe lighten my purse a little? Now hold on here. I'm not packing any heat. Ain't my word good enough for you? I suppose it's all right if there's no other choice. He's clean. See? Told you so. Looks like that guy's headed this way. Don't screw it up. Hey, looking for something to replace my old revolver. Mind if I head in? That's not really necessary, is it? I already told you I got this here revolver, right? Damn, I knew this wasn't gonna work. This I do not need today. Keep your head straight, Ripley. Things are about to get interesting. Hey, son. 
Simon? How's it hanging? Looks like you've got a little helper today. What can I say? Business has been good lately. I can afford to help. Good to hear, buddy. So is the boss lady in? You know she is. Why don't you go in and say hi? Nah, I got some rounds to run. But do pass along that I'm always thinking of her. Actually, I got a better idea. Make the new hire tell her. You'll do that for me, won't you? I would, but I tend to distract the boss lady a little too much. She can't help herself. Anyway, I got things to do. Later, Simon. Way to keep your head, rookie. Let's hope for you yet. It's just about closing time. Let's go see the boss about getting paid. Oh, I'm gonna need the rifle and armor back. Boss's orders. I was just telling Gloria about your performance. Hell of a first day, huh? Simon's been telling me how it went. Let's do a quick recap. You had a little bit of a hard time following instructions, but didn't do too bad overall. Here's your pay. Unfortunately, I found someone else with a little more experience, and he'll take over the position starting tomorrow. However, another task has come up that I could use some help with, assuming you're still interested in making some money. There's a deal that we've been working on for a while now, and the buyer would like a sample of our weapons. I need you to run a package out to a discreet location that the client has chosen. Sound good? Good. Here's the package. I'll mark the location on your map. The buyer said they'd be in town for quite a while, so there's no rush. That said, try not to dawdle. This client could mean big money for us, which naturally means big money for you. Glory's the one you want to talk to about working for us. I just handled the details. Keep moving.
Are you the Van Graaff's emissary? Do you have what we requested? Ah, huh. then our business is concluded. Tell your superiors that we will contact them shortly. We've already concluded our business. I suggest you return to your employers. Welcome back. Did you have news for me, or are you just here for the guns? And? Don't leave me in suspense. What was their reaction? Good. Good. Here's your payment. If you'll excuse me, I have some thinking to do. Oh. Jean-Baptiste was talking about a matter earlier that he needs help with. I volunteered you. See him for the details. Ah. Just the person I was looking for. Your name came up in a discussion we had recently. My sister is very impressed with you so far, but I'm not. I don't think you have what it takes to work for this family. Luckily for you, I'm going to give you a chance to prove me wrong. What do you say? Want to make some real money? All right, then. If we're going to work together, there's only one thing you need to know about me. I like things simple. Recently, Glory negotiated a deal between us and a big-time player. We're talking more caps than you'd probably see in a lifetime. Your part in this is simple. To finalize this deal, I need to tie up a loose end. To do that, there's a girl I need you to find. Her name is Rose of Sharon Cassidy. That's some fancy shit, right? Don't know what her mother was thinking with a name like that. But this girl and I, we need to have a discussion. Find her. Bring her here so I can talk to her one-on-one. -on -one. Really, NCR all around her. Well, tell you what, you find a way to bring her here. She'll want to hear what I have to say. You don't want us chatting, trust me. That's for the girl, and if you can't bring her here, then you're no use to me. Fine by me. Face-to-face -face meeting with House, huh? NCR would kill to be in your shoes. If that's what you think. All right. Guess I'll be around Novak for a while longer until I figure out what I want to do with myself. You watch.
You come around like a bad habit. What's on your mind? Jean Baptiste. Sounds like someone got knocked out of the good book so hard his name broke. Either that, or it's Canadarian or some such shit. So who is this Baptiste, and what does he want? The only Van Graffs I know are the ones out west. Well, except for Gloria Van Graff, and I don't know her all that well. Nor do I want to. Don't have any objections speaking with him. Though if he's with the Van Graffs, he should know I'm not looking to buy weapons. Go with you? So if walking the Mojave with you can't be any worse than here, that's for sure. All right, I'm in. Feels good now. Let's see what you got. We shouldn't be in here. Welcome back. As I live and breathe, Rose of Sharon Cassidy, the late Rose of Sharon Cassidy, was hoping you were on that caravan I massacred. But Crimson Caravan and Van Graffs won't need to worry about you anymore. Mojave's ours, and we're shutting you down for good. Really? We'll see about that. Hi, I'm John Baptiste, and you're about to stop being a pain in my ass. Like that. Well, now that I'm free of... I...
God, there's almost nothing left. Looks like whoever it was, was just in the mood for killing. Most of the cargo's ash, too. Not burn, looks like disintegrated. When I heard the reports, I assumed ash meant burned. So close to the Vegas wall, too. Don't that beat all. Must have happened during the day, though. They hadn't made a camp. Not sure. We should... Whatever we find, it's yours. You know what? What happened in my caravan? Not the first time I've heard about an attack like that. One of our caravans got hit a few months back, and the caravan been burned too, along with the cargo. I wonder if he made the same mistake, and that other caravan got hit with energy weapons too. All right then, let's move out. Sure could use a drink. More energy weapons hit this caravan. Place has been picked clean. This is Brotherhood level murder here. But they don't do things like that. This was done with a purpose. Let's poke around a bit, see what we can find. Might be something in the wreckage.
What's that? Looks like a map. Got the route along the west of Vegas, and they've marked another spot. Over here along this stretch. That's fucked up. Middle of nowhere. Yeah. It's not any closer than the first. So if you'd rather let be, let me know. All this traveling's making me thirsty. Another caravan burned, except someone made camp here, and I never heard about this attack. Let's look around. Something stinks. You've done a good turn for the NCR, and now we'd like to do one for you. There's an NCR emergency two-way radio. You call, and we'll come running. You're not alone out here. The NCR has your back. Stay safe and good hunting. That does it. That's all I need to know. Crimson Caravan and the Van Graffs. They were behind burning these caravans, and they've got to answer for them. I'm gonna get some extra ammo, a few bottles of whiskey, and then show them how Cassidy's settle accounts. NCR? Are you out of your fucking mind? That'd take years. And with the war with the Legion, no way they're gonna waste time running up the Crimson Caravan or the Van Graffs. All right. If you poke around the Van Graffs and Alice, fine. But if I see either one go into their camp, I'm gonna start shooting, no matter what you find. I'm already shadowing you, aren't I? Gift for my dad, along with my name. Rose of Sharon Cassidy. Mom said he got the name out of some old world book about derp. Anyway, you know. 
Ma as got his name, got short of and he some Staying low. Look, McLafferty's a hard boss, but she knows what she's doing, that's for sure. You find any evidence yet? I'm not gonna wait forever. So there's just one more safe to crack? Hope you can get to it. Say what you will about the two leading ladies. They watch their lockers like crows. Still, you got one, so the other might not be impossible. If you get both, then let's talk. And I appreciate you putting yourself at risk like this. Thanks. Once had a king following me, like I was following you. Had to chase him off with a shotgun, finally. I'll hold up here. We're watching you closely.
You find any evidence yet? I'm not gonna wait forever. No shit. There it is. The blood, the motive, as clear as day. They must have penned these with snake venom. But... We got it. Now what? Sure, this damns them, but only if someone listens. Well, Jackson and the Mojave Outpost could get it to the folks in the West. I wouldn't trust anyone closer to the Colorado. And the Crimson Caravan and the Van Graffs have their heart back west. Not sure it'll do any good, though. All right, let's do it. Listen to what he has to say. Appreciate the help. Wish I had more work for you, but nothing else on the radar at the moment. What is it? Let me see. All right, this is... This explains a lot of the lost caravans. I thought it was Legion work, but... I can, if you make me a promise. I need you to swear you won't take revenge on Gloria or Alice. If you do, then your case is over, and we can't see that justice is done. I know some things are hard to let go, but you and Miss Cassidy need to understand that. Hear me? That'll have to do. God, what a mess. People turning against each other when the Mojave's at risk of falling? If the Republic's sinkhole progress doesn't kill us, greed will. Thanks for bringing me this. I know revenge must have been tempting. For what it's worth, I appreciate you didn't shed any more blood. We need to save our strength for the Legion. God, what a mess. People turning against each other. If the... I'll do what I can. And those folks that got killed need to be answered for. Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winter.
Let's hit the road. Well, that's settled. I... No. No, I know. Just hard to say how I feel right now. Wait, that's not true. I think the NCR back west, when riled, is gonna be the worst enemy the Van Graffs and the Crimson Caravan ever had. They're all so mired in procedure and paper out there. The kind of evidence we gave is going to be worse than shooting them. I think that settles accounts with me and my men. That was some tricky political maneuvering, but worth it, even if it takes a few years. All right, then. As I live and breathe, Rose of Sharon Cassidy, the late Rose of Sharon Cassidy, was hoping you were on that caravan I massacred. But Crimson Caravan and Van Graffs won't need to worry about you anymore. Wahhabi's ours, and we're shutting you down for good. Waited too long to finish this. Last loose end, all wrapped up. Hi, I'm John Baptiste, and you're about to stop being a pain in my ass. Ah! Oh, that was fun. Did you see the look on that bitch's face? Priceless. Anyway, Glory's been antsy lately because that big deal she's been working on is finally going down. If this thing goes down, We'll have it made. Fucking made, I tell you. Talk to her about it. I'm sure she'll want you along. And don't think I forgot your pay. A job well done is its own reward. But it doesn't pay for pussy at the local brothel, does it? 